All right guys, so we're off to the gym again today. So obviously yesterday I hit uh, squats, deadlifts, and bench press, one rep max day. Um, we're gonna hit chest again today. Uh, probably did only about 10 sets, uh, 10, uh, sorry, 10 sets, 10 reps overall uh, yesterday on my chest. So I feel very fresh. Uh, normally I say you don't wanna work the same body part two days in a row. However, I feel like today I can definitely get away with it. You know, barely worked chest at all really yesterday. I know it was heavy, but I feel fresh. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get in, do seven exercises, where I like, normally like to work hit seven exercises on a body part chest and triceps um, today so it'll be three sets on each 21 sets overall no more than 30 seconds between each set I like to keep it as intense as possible when I'm working out so obviously that's just to, to burn as much fat as possible at the same time and really get a good sweat on um, you see too many people in the gym spending two hours in there and I really don't see the point of that you know you can get in you can get out have a really intense decent workout and uh, you've still got the rest of the day ahead of you so uh, yeah I want to try and get back from my United again kicks off in about an hour hour and a half um, so yeah, I'll pick it up with you guys in the gym. We're going to kick off with some incline bench press, just on 80 kilos. So what I'm trying to do is make sure my uh, scapula is retracted, so my shoulders are back, I'm trying to pinch the, uh, the bench with my shoulder blades. Um, and I just want to make sure that I'm really focusing on my chest, focusing on my muscle connection um, to make sure I get a really good contraction. So that's what I'm going to go, not going super heavy, just focusing on um, a good solid movement. So I've just hit um, incline bench press, uh, barbell bench press uh, for six sets. So after the first set, which you just saw, um, I was hit about 14 reps and I was fresh uh, on that 80, but I dropped it down. I dropped, went up to 100 and then to 120, just to try and keep in that um, four to six rep range and then drop back down obviously as I started to tire. So now I'm gonna move on to cable fly. So I've got the, the cable set just above my shoulder height. So we're really gonna try and target my upper pack and just have a nice slow controlled motion to really target that chest there again, focusing on that mind-muscle connection. So we're moving on now, I've done the cable flies, just three sets, kept it on um, 80 pounds on each side. So uh, just really focusing on that mind muscle connection as I say. So we're moving on to um, lateral raises now. So I'm just going to use probably like probably 10 kilos on either side, really making sure that I'm concentrating, keeping my elbow higher than my wrist and making sure I'm contracting my trapezius. Uh, yeah, so that, that's kind of it basically. I want to make sure I keep my head up, really contract my, uh, my traps, my, my deltoids, make sure that I'm not use, trying to use my arms too much. So. You haven't seen me like this at all and all you know of me has gone away somehow and it's a shame to quit this game but I guess it makes things easy. Right, so now we're moving on to tricep extension. So I like to work an element of shoulders in pretty much every single workout I do because I don't really have a uh, shoulders day in my uh, split. So I just like to try and make sure that I hit my, uh, my traps and my delts at least once in every session. Um, that way I feel like I'm at least uh, over the course of the week hitting them consistently because for me it's like a weak body part so I'm best to just kind of keep hitting it consistently and eventually I'm going to, well I've started to see some gains. So uh, just for me that's what works. So moving on now to tricep extensions, so part of my chest day, always hit triceps, let's do it. So 
machine cable flies. Um, so what I like to do with this one is try and actually keep my arm out straight. Because for me it feels like I get a better contraction rather than having my hand up here. Um, so that's what I'm going to do now. So I'm going to go on a medium to heavy sort of weight. And again, I just want to focus on my chest. Given my triceps are great now, just hit them really hard in the tricep extension. So uh, yeah, let's just concentrate on my chest. Alright guys, so we're moving on to the shoulder press machine. So generally I like to try and stay away from machines just because they, they stabilise your muscles. So you don't necessarily get the same sort of toning advantage that you do, do from free weights. But nevertheless, I'm going to go for a shoulder press. Um, so what I'm going to try and do here is just make sure that I'm going to go fairly heavy. I want to make sure my head, my back stays against the pad. So otherwise it's, it takes some of the stress away from your shoulders. And it tends to, when I get tired, my head starts coming forward. So I just want to make sure that I'm focusing on. Final exercise of the day. Um, so I'm going to do dumbbell chest flies. Um, so I'm going to go again, pretty heavy. I'm going to go probably 35 kilos. Um, I'm really probably burn out now. So last three sets of days, give it. Everything. Right then guys, so final thing for the day, I thought I'd just give you a quick uh, physique update. So I'm currently at probably around about 12 to 14% body fat, um, about 90, 91 kilos, something like that. So just triceps. Abs are kind of there, kind of not. Start of the sort of cut at the moment. So to be honest, I'm not too displeased with where I'm at. Sorry about the heavy breathing, I'm a bit knackered off that workout now. Right side. So that's where I'm at guys, so fairly happy. Fairly happy, but I think probably sort of a few more weeks, a month down the line, hopefully those abs will be a little bit more defined. I'll be even happier. So that's where I'm at right now. Sun is shining in Watford. This is brilliant. So gym's done. We've got Protein shake in hand, life's good. Vest on for the first time this year outside. It's been a good sesh, so I'm really, I was quite pleased with that. I think in the end I ended up doing 24 sets instead of 21, but to be honest, I'm, I'm happy. I'm really happy. That was a really good session. When you're feeling good, you just got to keep going. And uh, now I'm just literally running home to get back for my United game. So I shall see you all next time. Thank you very much for watching.